Yo, what's going on guys? We are back uh, with another 82 no challenge video. Uh, you guys know what's up. We're in 2KMT Central and we're going to be drafting a team. Uh, we're doing a lowest overall draft. So out of every pack, uh, we're taking the lowest overall player. Uh, I am switching up a little bit. This is going to be the first episode where I change this up. I get to choose one pack before we start drafting. And that pack, I get to choose any player I want. Um, any player I want. Only one though. So... I'm definitely gonna go with the starting pack. I could definitely get a fire play. Ah, it's like, but if I go with a bench guy, like there's odds out of the bench pack, I'm gonna be, get a bad player. So then like that would guarantee me one good player off the bench and you'd still probably be getting a solid guy from all the starting uh, guys. You know what? 2K, 2K loves their big men. 2K loves their big men. So I'm gonna go my center pack. I am going to choose whichever player I want. Center pack. Any player I want. Eh, hold on. Ah, the shooting guard. I feel like we don't get solid players from the shooting guard spot a lot. And, like, we always get, like, decent guys for our centers. I'm going to go shooting guard. I'm going to go shooting guard. I feel like that's the position we fail at a lot. So I'm going to go shooting. Shooting guard spot. Final, final, final. We're already opening the packs. Shooting guard is our... The pack we're gonna choose any player we want dude this is what i'm talking about this is what i'm talking about if i chose it here we would have been getting a shack but now we're getting greg ostertag who i think we've had in one of the first um episodes where we started doing uh legend players but let me look him up yeah he's absolute cheeks he is absolute cheeks so let's get let's get the second pack let's let's heat up here let's heat up and we're gonna get jj reddick or dane nope we're gonna get rudy gay so two disappointing pulls right there i think the bench i think in future episodes i think the bench is definitely the way to go for my highest overall as we get wesley matthews here like that's what i'm saying we could have gotten like a t-mac i think bench is definitely the way to go because you're probably gonna get a solid guy out of the starting lineup anyway oh my gosh we almost got kobe we almost got Kobe. We get Evan Fournier, who's like an 81 overall, so definitely a respectable player. Him, Rudy Gay, I think will definitely get minutes right now with how this is looking. Oh my gosh. Oh my. We got Dirk! We get Dirk! Oh my gosh. This is absolute fire. Um. Oh, I, I just. Yeah, I have nothing to say. Dirk is fantastic. I'm pretty sure he's going to. Pretty sure his all-time version is going to be like a 97 overall or something like that. So, an absolute stud. An absolute stud. And, oh my gosh, I saw some fire players in this one. We do end up with Alec Burks. Seven, uh, he's like a 78 overall. Probably not going to get minutes. I'm just happy we got Dirk, man. I'm super happy. So, I'm also super happy that I didn't choose the power forward spot for my uh, player now. Otherwise, it would have been like... Uh, like it would like I already have Dirk. So so here we have two eighty eight overalls. Mario Hazonia I know is trash. You guys know I hate him so much. He's preventing me from getting some good players. So I will look up this Latrell's brew will dude. There's an eighty four overall version of him on the eighty eight eighty nine Knicks. So definitely not um a terrible pull. Um small fo so we have small forward, power forward, shooting guard, small forward. So we need we need a point guard and we need a a center so we need a big man or a guard right here let's hopefully we get it as we get two oh uh, we get 80 damon stoudemire oh my gosh he's like a 87 overall i want to say he's a mid to high 80 overall uh which is super nice and that was a position we really needed so honestly we start off rough but we get these three so these four guys maybe five guys getting minutes um off the bench uh, you definitely got at least three guys getting minutes. Uh, probably definitely four guys getting minutes. But so I said the shooting guard was our path. So I'm gonna do that one uh, last. Um, we're gonna start off with the center pack as we get 290 overalls. David West, he's retired, right? I'm like 90% sure David West is retired, bro. He is, but he's not in 2K. If you guys look at sometimes. Uh, like he he's on the all-time new orleans pelicans team but he has like no attribute rankings and i'm pretty sure he's not actually in the game 
Bro, that is an absolute trash pull now. This is absolutely trash. Because now we get Ennis Cantor. I'm definitely going to mark that down. I'm going to mark it down David West. Just in case he actually is in 2k. Because like it says he was in 2k. But he's not. It also says. Because there's no ranking. Or there's no attributes for him. So I'm not 100% sure. Um, let's see what we get out of this pack. Another David West, so we can't take him, which means we get Elvin Hayes, who I believe we've had recently. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure we've had him recently. So 95 overall, very solid, very solid player. I'm actually very uh, happy. So we have two, so Elvin Hayes slash Dirk, one of them can definitely run center. Probably Elvin Hayes, because Dirk isn't necessarily known as a great defender. So... Honestly, we have a very solid starting lineup. And Ennis Cantor, I'm fine bringing off the bench because he's like an 81 overall still. Right? Or he's like a 79. Is he 79 or 81? I forget. But let's see what we got out of this point guard spot. And we are going to get CJ McCollum. Definitely not who I wanted when we had like a Tim Hardaway. Oscar Robertson, we almost had him. Man. CJ, definitely not bad. I believe he is an 84 overall, so... But we have Damon Stoudemire to start point guard, which is solid. And then he'll be back up. Let's see who we get here. This is the pack where we can choose any player we want. So let's hopefully we get solid. We got Penny Hardaway, Daniel Gibson, Steve Francis, Jerry Stackhouse, Zach Levine. So not the greatest. I do want to look up Jerry Stackhouse and Steve Francis. I don't know what their overalls are. But I'm probably going to go with Penny Hardaway. I think I'm going to end up going with Penny Hardaway. Yeah, Penny Hardaway. Eh, Penny Hardaway is definitely the guy in 95 overall. Other two guys weren't even 90s, so I was surprised. Uh, so yeah, Penny Hardaway is now our starting point guard. CJ might be our starting shooting guard. I don't really know yet, but probably. And then Damian can come off the bench. Evan Fournier can come off the bench. Latrell can come off the bench. So actually, we have a, this is a very solid team. This is a very solid team. So, so hopefully we get a solid guy here as we get oh i thought we were gonna get lebron we get richard lewis let me look him up uh very solid player though i know i know for a fact he's a great player from the 2000s eh, 88 overall obviously no lebron but can't complain there the only thing is he's like a he's a stretch for is the thing i think latrell I think this is definitely the lineup, and then we bring these four guys off the bench. He'll be like point guard, shooting guard, shooting guard, small forward, power forward. I don't know if he was also a center, or let me look up his height. Okay, so he's 6'10", but he his backup position is small forward, so... And then we got Ennis Cantor, so this is actually a really solid team. Uh, let me go put it on 2K, and we'll see what this team can do. All right, so we're here with the team. We got Penny, we got CJ, we got Latrell, Elvin, and Dirk. Um, then off the bench, we got Richard, Damon, Stoudemire, Evan Fournier, and Ennis Cantor. We are running the nine-man rotation. Uh, we got nothing there. System proficiency, we're running triangle. I mean, you guys see, it works really well with this team. Uh, if I started Richard Lewis, it would be even better, but still four-star. So I'm fine running Richard off the bench as the power forward small forward backup so that's what the team was um i didn't actually have anything to change 2k had the lineup that i really liked so let's hope this team can do really well after looking at the team i just don't know i don't know i we have great big men we have great big men but our shooting guard small fours aren't as great as i wanted it to be our backup center isn't as good i Definitely don't think this is one of the best teams we've had, but it still should be about a 70 game winner. Definitely a little disappointing, 66 and 16. I thought this was team, team was a little better, but you know, if, if we're not gonna go 82 and 0, I mean, if we're not even gonna go like 75 plus wins, it doesn't really matter that much. But here are the awards. We didn't have anybody we are coach of the year. Obviously we were that Boston Celtics team with Dirk making the all NBA second team and Elvin Hayes making the third team. I knew we had great big men. And that's all the awards. Obviously, we're first seed. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Milwaukee did have a fairly good sim. Uh, Lakers had a fantastic sim. Holy crap. Usually, they don't have that good of a sim. 
Um, but 65 wins, that's nothing to joke about. Offensively, this was the best team. Defensively, we were the third best team, but point differential goes, yeah, we were the best team. So that just goes to show that we were a lot better than everybody else. Dirk, almost 30 points a game. Holy crap. Triangle offense excels with this man. 12 and a half rebounds, Penny Hardaway 19, 6 and a half and 9. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Elvin Hayes 15 and 14. Uh, CJ 15. Uh, Latrell 14. So very nice. This is the rest of the people. Um, always like looking at this real fast. See who goes 50, 40, 90. So a lot. We shot well from three. So Dirk goes 50, 40, 90, which is fantastic. So this was a very efficient team. Worked so insanely. Not surprisingly. I'm almost said surprisingly. It wasn't surprisingly that they worked well together. Uh, knew they were going to close that game against the Magic. Absolutely blew them out by over 30 points. Uh, Dirk, Penny Hardaway, and Richard Lewis all uh, get over 20 points. Yeah. Team late against the Raptors. Yep, yeah, beat them in five. Uh, the box score. Elvin Hayes this time, 31 in the closeout. Dirk Nowitzki still puts up 25, 16, and six. Sorry, 12 and six. Not 16 and six. We got the Brooklyn Nets here. Milwaukee lost first round to the Celtics. That's crazy. Uh, we win five again. Uh, simulate the rest of the round real fast. So Dirk again, 34 and 12 with four steals and two blocks. Absolutely ridiculous. Um, very efficient shooting um, and again 15 points not super close so we win in five games every round now we got the clippers who have lost less games than we have in the playoffs wow that's surprising uh but uh, i'm gonna simulate this game by game possibly go in in the last game just to get some gameplay yeah we're up 3-0 oh no i didn't want to see me cast live no um We're gonna jump in, okay. We're gonna jump in right there and then we're gonna, nope, I didn't wanna do that. Okay, jump in. We need to get this game to start so we can just sim cast it normally. We lose the tip, but it's whatever. We're gonna sim cast. Um, we're just gonna simula simulate to like a few minutes left and probably jump in if it's not. Yeah, probably gonna get some gameplay in since it's not a super close game. Yeah, two and a half minutes left. Oop. Okay, two nineteen left. Uh, we're on superstar difficulty, I believe, but there's no chance I'm gonna lose this game. Oop. Does anybody else hate gameplay in this game? I don't know if it's that I'm on PC or what. Oh, yo, why are you coming out here? Dude, I don't need the help. Defense, bro. Just let me do me and you do you, bro. Okay. That was the worst screen in the history of screens. Let's see what we get. We get a nice jumper right there with, uh, nope. I think that was Damon Stoudemire. Yeah. He's up to 10 points, 7 assists. Nice. Nice. Someone get him on the wing. Oh my gosh, bro. Come on. Oh, that was Paul George. No wonder. Let's get it to uh, Penny here. But yeah, as I was saying, everything feels really delayed. I don't know if it's just 2K at, in general. Nice pull up there. He misses. Dirk gets the rebound. Oh, let's go. Dirk 23 and 13. Um, I don't know if it's just that on my PC, but it's so annoying. Like, I... Because... Okay, the la I didn't have 2K19, but I had 2K18 for Xbox, and there was not, like, this kind of delay. Like, this, I don't know if it's just how they made 2K this year, but that was so delayed. That was so delayed. So, I don't know if it's just the gameplay is really trash, because I know the gameplay is trash, but I don't know if it's, like, because that, everything just feels really, like, lazy. Oh, my gosh. Ooh, we're driving. Let's go, Penny! 13-4 and 6 in the final game for him so far. Oh my gosh. Really? Really? No chance. I've never gotten that animation before. I don't get those kind of animations. 
2K is so busted, it's unbelievable. Marcus, I don't give a shit if you pull up. I, I like how I got the animation where I blocked him just now. That's really cool. Wait, what? Did they call timeout or what? I thought that was a jump ball. Okay, I like how he stole it there too. We're pulling. We're pulling! Oh. Sweet. We win the finals. Pretty lit. Uh, It was a given. We lose three games in the playoffs, so it was really nice. We kind of just blew by everybody. Took five games, five games, five games, four games. So, pretty nice. Sweet. So, there you guys go. Dirk is the finals MVP at 29 and a half, 12. Four assists, so shot fantastic from the field. Could have shot better from three with it being 2K. You know, he should have been shooting like 45%, but that's just me. That's just my opinion. But there you guys go. Um, Nothing really significant in this 82 and 0. Uh, we only go 16, or 66 six and 16. Uh, but yeah, I really like the addition of the one spot where I can pick by player. I definitely think I'm going to run with the, uh, probably do that for like a bench spot. Uh, just because, you know, the odds of getting a better player um, having a significant improvement is way more if I do it in the bench pack. So, see you guys in the next one. Um, if you guys enjoyed, make sure to like and subscribe, and peace. Mm.